This video is geared towards our customers, but if you are watching this video and you own a cell phone repair business, it's good for you to know, and it's good for you to offer this to your customers. So what we see here are three different types of screens, and the, the model that we're using is an iPhone 10, and we're going to go into fine detail as far as the differences between the three different screens that you see here. So we'll begin with what we will call option A, option B, and option C. First of all, one thing we wanted to point out is on all three options, if you decide to replace your screen with us, you will get True Tone transferred. And what that means is we would use a programmer such as this one that you see here to transfer the True Tone from your iPhone screen, the broken one, into the new one. This is done across the board on all three options. Not many cell phone repair businesses will offer True Tone and you would need to have a programmer like this one to be able to do that. That's one of the things that all of them have. And then you have your basic quality, your high quality, and then you have your premium highest quality available. So we would go into details between the differences between all of these so you can have a better understanding. The best way I can describe it is take the analogy of an oil change on your car. You go in for an oil change and they'll say, okay, we'll just give you regular oil change or you can have a semi-synthetic oil change or a full synthetic oil change. So you have the option as a consumer to go with good, better, and best when it comes to quality. And when you have your cell phone screen replaced, you also want to have that option. Most cell phone repair businesses won't give you options, but guess what they're installing on your phone? This one right here. And guess what they're not doing? They're not going to transfer True Tone from your screen, your original screen, into your replacement screen. And we're being very transparent because we're going to tell you what you get and hence you're going to see a little bit of a price difference from option A to option B to option C. Obviously as a consumer you're always going to want the best so if you were to change the oil on your car and you want your car to last you longer you're going to go with the synthetic oil change or at least a semi-synthetic but if your budget conscience and uh, you know money is an issue, then it's okay to go with good, especially if your phone is blacked out and you have no image, but you just need to have the phone screen replaced. Let's begin with the good option A. It is an aftermarket quality. The choice is a great budget-friendly choice like we mentioned. It's a good quality LCD and gets your phone working again. In the case of a non-working or damaged phone. True Tone, like we mentioned before, gets transferred. This is in the case of the iPhone 8 or newer, as long as the True Tone was present previously. Now, your better quality or your higher quality LCD is also an LCD. Now, you, you got to keep in mind that the iPhone 10, the iPhone 11 Pro, the 11 Pro Max, all the 12s and all the 13s do not have LCDs, but they are available as a replacement for your phone. These two are LCDs and this is what those phones that we mentioned, the 10, the 11 Pro, 11 Pro Max, all the 12s and all the 13s, this is what they have, an OLED screen, and we'll go into that a little bit later. So describing the better quality or the one in the middle, it is a higher quality LCD over the aftermarket quality. You can see where there's a better distinction between the grays over here, especially on these two, than, than over here. This one is like more, this, you'll get more vivid colors starting here on the better quality. So it includes a weather strip seal. Let me explain that in a minute. And that's what this is. The weather strip seal is something that's around your phone and when you open up the phone and remove the screen, the weather strip seal, most of it stays on the base. And when we go with the good, you'll just get the screen in there 
and we try to take advantage of the weather strip seal that's already there but starting here we completely give you a brand new weather strip seal this even anytime a phone is opened it voids the manufacturer warranty but this will give you a better chance of your phone not being water damaged having a new one put in than using the old one so starting here you're gonna get a better screen and you get a weather strip seal included as part of the repair and that's what you're gonna get here and obviously you can see that there's a better distinction between the grays over here than you see here you're also going to get the true tone transfer like we mentioned before and this is going to occur on iPhone 8 or newer and here's our true tra transfer machine true tone transfer machine excuse me you'll get your true tone transferred on your iPhone 8 or newer as long as it was there before now to describe the best quality screen which is an OLED screen and not an LCD these two are LCDs we'll go into a little bit detail here on your best available quality which is a premium quality so this is the OLED screen it is used in the case where the phone originally was equipped with an OLED screen like I mentioned before iPhone 10 iPhone 11 Pro 11 Pro Max all the 12s and all the 13s come with an OLED screen this is what Apple put on these iPhones so this is what most most of these newer iPhones come with OLED screens OLED screens are also you also use less power on your battery than these two so the the LCD screens will draw more power on your battery this one does not that's why in the last couple years if you've owned some of the newer iPhones the batteries were doing so much better because they started going into OLED screens the OLED screen also is the best choice for the highest quality the highest resolution the most vibrant color displays that's what you're seeing on the right additionally just like in the case of the one in the middle we would also replace your weather strip seal and put a brand new one on the screen as well but here's another thing that you get with these OLED screens when you replace them with us you will have a lifetime warranty on the OLED so the OLED is what's behind the glass so the OLED is actually if you look here the OLED is basically the display of the of the phone of the whole screen assembly it is not the glass itself so you see how this glass is cracked that's not the OLED the OLED is the actual display and then after the display you have the glass which which we just showed you so we will give you a lifetime warranty on the OLED display meaning that if the OLED goes black if it develops lines you will get the whole thing replaced for free the only thing that will void the warranty is you cannot bring it in with the glass cracked if if the glass is cracked like you see here that means you dropped it and that's why the OLED is not displaying or that's why it has lines but if it just starts to develop lines all of a sudden or doesn't display all of a sudden as long as there's no cracks on the glass and as long as there's no signs of water damage on the phone and what I mean by that is there's a chip down here and if water gets in through your through your phone at the bottom and hits this chip it will turn off your display if we see any signs of water damage here that will also void the warranty but if your OLED decides to go black on you or develop lines and there's no signs of water damage or signs that means we will replace it for you so let's go into showing you some of the differences so you can see the different qualities we already went into what you're getting with the good the better and the best and basically it's it's up to the consumer we don't try to push one over the other obviously the best quality is on the right it'll be the best one on your battery it'll give you the best vibrant displays but let's go ahead and show you some differences so when we are at a white background you can see you may not be able to see it very well on the camera let me see if I turn on an, an exterior light source and see if that would help 
maybe, maybe not. But in person, in person, this one here looks more pinkish. This one looks less pinkish than this one, although on camera it looks more pinkish. But your best color option when you're talking about the real vivid color displays, what your eyes see, it's this one here. It's hard to describe that on camera, but this one gives you the best light displays. Here we are on a total, totally white screen. When we go to dark, let's see, here we go. When we go to dark, you can see where these two look similar, but you're also going to get a better battery life on this one. And here we have a, an internet page on Google. And you can still see where this one still shows a little bit of the white is not like truly white like it is on this one. And let's see, let's go to images. And from what I see in person, obviously this one has the best picture as far as the vivid colors. This one has the second best and of course this one is in third place. And, and folks, there's a reason why we give you that option, good, better, best. And we want to be very transparent, show you the customer, the differences between the three quality screens out there, but also let you know what you're getting as far as your weather strip seal on these two. And obviously on option C, on the best quality, you're going to get an OLED lifetime warranty and your battery will thank you for it as well so hope this video was helpful for everyone if you have any questions or comments please write them down put them down at the uh, after the description on the video and also please subscribe to the video give us a, th a thumbs up if you'd like more information on this base that we have here please also comment and let us know as well Thank you very much for watching. You all have a great day.